All right, Shalom. First and foremost, I'm going to give all praises, honor, and glory unto Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shah, Bahashem, and Kabkadash. Double honors to the apostles and the elders, the great millstone, they were well, and the salute, and the Shalom to all the Akim that are out here laboring and pushing this truth in all sincerity and in truth. Uh, let's get this. This is Jeremiah chapter 30 and verse 7. It says, Alas, for that day is great, so that none is like it. It is even the time of Jacob's trouble, but he shall be saved out of it. Now, who will be saved out of Jacob's trouble? The elect of Jacob, the elect of the nation of Israel. Okay? Let's get Daniel. 12 and 1 it says and at that time shall Michael stand up the great prince which standeth for the children of thy people and there shall be a time of trouble such as never was since there was a nation even to that same time and at that time thy people shall be delivered everyone that is found written in the book right now it says what says that there shall be a time of trouble okay so so that time of trouble is fast approaching okay that time of trouble is fast approaching man right man and and everyone will be affected by it man right man everyone will be affected by that time of trouble man Let's get, let's get Zephaniah real quick. Hold on. I don't, I don't think it's Zephaniah. Hold on real quick. That's not the one I'm looking for. Well, then it's, hold on. Hold on. Is it Zephaniah? Okay. This is, uh. This is Zephaniah 1 and 14 to 15. It says, It says, The great day of Yahweh, Bahashem Yahweh is near. It is near and hasteth greatly. Even the voice of the day of Yahweh, Bahashem Yahweh shall the mighty men cry there bitterly. Right? Right, man? So even. So, so even these mighty men, when that day comes, man, they will be afraid, afraid, man. Right, man? So, so the, so the great day of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh is a day of death, is a day of, it is a day of death and bloodshed and judgment, man. Okay. Right, man, and there will be judgment being poured out on the world, man. It says, that day is a day of wrath, a day of trouble and distress, a day of wasteness and desolation, a day of darkness and gloominess, a day of clouds and thick darkness. Right? All right, man. So in that day, uh, uh, um, it's going to seem like, 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 like there is no hope, right? But there is hope, though, man. All right, man. There is hope for the elect of the nation of Israel. All right, man. Now, uh, 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 everybody else, they're fucked. Period. All right, man. But there is hope for the elect of the nation of Israel, man. Because it says what? In in Daniel 12. It says. And at that time. Shall Michael stand up. The great prince. Which standeth for the children of thy people. And there shall be a time of trouble. Such as never was. Since there was a nation. Even to that. Same time. Uh, and at that time. Thy people shall be delivered. Now. 
who is the people that will be delivered? The elect of the nation of Israel. Okay? It says, everyone that is found written in the book, right? So, so, all right, man. So, so, so only the elect of the nation of Israel will be found and are found in the book, man. And what book is that, man? The Bible. Okay? Let's get Amos 5. Amos 5. Hold on, I think it's 5. Let's see. No, I think it's 5. Hold on. Okay, Connie. Here it is. This is, um... God, this, is, uh, this is Amos 5 and 18. It says, Woe unto you that desire the day of Yahweh by, by Shemiah was shot. To what, end is it, to what end is it for you? The day of Yahweh by Shemiah was shot is darkness and not light. All right? So, the day of Yahweh by Shemiah was shot is a terrible, horrible day. A day, man, because many people will die all right man and judgment will be raining in the streets streets man all right man and you won't be able to leave the house man all right man all right man uh all right man uh, uh your homes your homes will be getting broken into man okay it say as if a man did flee from a lion and a bear met him or went into the house and leaned his hand on the wall and a serpent bit him. Now, now this is a, a metaphor for, for, uh, for, uh, for, for, for what, man? Basically, man, th th there will be danger at every turn, man. All right, man, there will be danger and judgment at every turn, man. So you won't escape, man. You won't be able to escape, man. All right, all right, man, and and you people will find out who did this, man. You people will find out that the God of Abraham, the God of Isaac, and the God of Jacob has done this, man. All right, man, you people will know that Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shah has done this. All right, man, and in the names, all right, man, in the names, Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shah. Will be known in that day, man. All right, man. And when, all right, man. And all right, man. And will reign supreme, man, in the earth. Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shah. It says, Shall not the a day of Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shah, be darkness and not light, even very dark and no brightness in it? All right, man. Because in ancient Egypt, man, what happened, man? Hold on, hold on. Let's get this. What is it? I believe it's uh, yeah, right here. This is uh, Wisdom of Solomon. All right, Wisdom of Solomon, seventeen. It says, God it says, uh. This is Wisdom of Solomon 17 and 1. It says, For great are thy judgments, it cannot be expressed. Therefore, unnurtured souls have erred. For when unrighteous men thought to oppress the holy nation, right? Who's that? Who is that holy nation, man? We are, Yasha Allah. Right? It says, They being shut up in the houses, the prisoners of, of darkness, and fettered with the bonds of a long night. Lay their exile from the eternal providence, right? For while they supposed to lie hid in their secret sins, they were scattered under a dark veil of forgetfulness, being horribly astonished and troubled with strange apparitions. All right? 
So, the day of Yahweh Basham Yahweh is also a day of strange apparitions, man. You people will be seeing demons, man. All right, man, you people will be seeing demons manifesting themselves before your eyes, man. You will be seeing that, man. Strange apparitions, man. You will be seeing that. Right, it says, For neither might the corner that held them keep them from fear, but noises as of waters falling down sounded about them. All right? And sad visions appeared unto them with heavy countenances. Demons, man, you will be seeing that. Okay? It says, No power of the fire might give them light, neither could the bright flames of that kind. It says, uh, uh, Of the stars endure to lighten that horrible night. Mm. Mm. It says, Only there appeared unto them a fire kindled of itself, very dreadful for being much terrified. They thought the things which they saw to be worse than the sight they saw not. As for the illusions of art magic, they were put down, and their vaunting in wisdom was reproved with disgrace. It says for they that promised to drive away the terrors and troubles from a sick soul were sick themselves of fear worthy to be laughed at right for though no terrible thing did f did fear them yet being scared with beasts that passed by and hissing of serpents right so in that day, man. You people will be afraid, man. You people will fear, man. You people will fear, man. Like, man, this ain't no joke, joke, man. This is not a joke, man. This is the day of Yahweh Bashem Yahushai that's fast approaching, man. All right, man, and you people will will know why why you people will know why Yahweh was known by kind of was known as Alashadia you people will understand and know why Yahweh was known by Alashadia right Allah is power right and and Shadia is what demon Demon-like power. Okay? So what manner of, of person ought ye to be, man, in that day, man? Well, 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 uh, 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 what manner of person, uh, uh, um, uh, what manner of person ought ye to be as of right now? Let's get that. Second Peter three and uh Con in the in eleven. Second Peter three and eleven it says, Seeing then that all these things shall be dissolved, what manner of persons are ye to be in all holy conversation and godliness? Right, so so you so you're supposed to be watching, man. Okay. You're supposed to uh, 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 be on your best behavior, man. Like, right, man, and stay on the good side of your Howard Basham Let's get, uh, Amos 3 and 6. That's the last one. Amos 3 and 6, it says, Shall a trumpet be blown in the city, and the people not be afraid? Shall, shall there be evil in the city, and Yahweh hath not done it? Okay, so when, so when, judgment, uh, um, um, is, is raining on the earth, who's doing that, man? Yahweh Bashem Yahushua is doing that. 
Well, let's get another one. Yeah, Deuteronomy 32 and 39. It say, See now that I, even I, am he, and there is no God with me. I kill and I make alive. I wound and I heal. Neither, it says, Neither is there any that can deliver out of my hand. All right? So when it's your time to go, it's your, it's your time to go, man. You cannot escape the hands of Yahweh Basham Yahushah. You can't, man. You can't. All right, man. And you people that's going to be calling on Jesus, guess what? <laughs> guess what, man? He ain't going to help you, man. He he ain't going to help you, man. All right, man? And you you people that's going to be calling on uh, on on uh, um, on uh, uh, Allah, he ain't going to help you, man. He ain't going to help, man. All right, man? Buddha ain't going to help you, man. Christ, he ain't going to help you, man. You cannot escape the hands of Yahweh Bashem Yahusha. Right? Let's get another one. I believe it's, it's, I believe it's 1 Samuel 26. Kind of says, 1 Samuel 2, it's like it. 1 Samuel 26, it says, Yahweh killeth and maketh alive. He bringeth down to the grave and bringeth up. Right? So the evil that's that's coming. Alright, man. So so the bad time that's that's coming, man, because evil means bad time, right? Alright, man. So who's so who's bringing that that bad time, man? Yahweh Bashem Yahushai is. Why? Because he's sick of you people, man. Yahweh Bashem Yahushai is fed up with you motherfuckers, man. He's fed up with you, man. You all have to go, man. You all must be destroyed. You all must go. Right? So with that, I say, Shalom, all praises to Yahweh Bashem Yahushai, Bashem Rekab Kadash. Uh, double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone. They were well. And a salute and a shalom to all the Akim that's out here laboring and pushing his truth and all sincerity and the truth. And with that, I say shalom.